Welcome back to the channel Team Explorers. Thanks for joining us for another video on Team Exploring UK. And um, yeah, it's been a bit of a bit of a tough one. I've been very busy with work, so I've not put as many videos out as I'd like to as of lately. Um, but yeah, I've literally just headed over to the location I wanted to do the next video at. Um, it's been like up to 20 degrees heat all day. It's been absolutely fantastic. It's been a beautiful day. And as I get over to the tops, I'm about seven minutes away from the location. It just started absolute bouncing down with rain. So I have turned around. And then when I when I dropped back down to the bottom of the hill, it calmed down again. So I've just, instead of going back over, I've, um, I've decided to come to another location. I'm not sure whether we can get in. On the way here, I kind of had it in my head that I'll just go and scope it out and see if there is access. And if there is, we can come back and do a night video because I'm really, really excited to get another night exploring. I feel like it's been a while since since we got one of them in. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to record just because it could be open and we could get a great video. Um, and then obviously we can come back at night if, if we miss anything and we want to see it in a bit of a darker light, so to speak. So yeah, I'm going to get geared up now and head up there. I'll flip it around and give you a show. So we've got an abandoned church, as you can see there. I do have the drone with me. So I'm going to get geared up and just have um, a little walk up the track. As you can see, we're just entering this little track now because that see some graves. Not sure, I think it's a bit touch and go at this location. Sometimes there's, there's a way in and sometimes there isn't. A couple of paths. We'll take the main path up. Quite a lovely ground to be honest, if it was um, maintained, it looked really nice. I'm not sure why it's closed. Let's have a look at graveyard. Nice big beautiful building. Be nice to get the drone up here. And yeah, I don't think we're getting in. It's all nice and uh, nice and blocked off today. There's a steel door behind that as well, so I'm not sure how other people have been getting in. It's um, yeah, it's got steel on all doors and windows. Yeah, not sure about that one. It's just as and when the um, young ones come and rip that front off, I suppose. Big ass cable pulled off. Yeah. Some lovely stonework. Gotta appreciate it. Someone's pinched that piece. What the Queen dead? Oh, what a shame. There's a couple of people sat in the back garden. But yeah, as you can see, you're not getting in there. Some king, king ones on that. Yeah, it's just beautiful. Really nice uh, gravestones. It's a bit of a building site around here now. 
Got all nice new padlocks on. It's a bit of an excavation going on. Some new gas works. Don't mind the wasting the money doing that. That side's all tech screwed up. So yeah, you're definitely not getting in the place. But yeah, that would have been lovely to see. But yeah, all the doors are just literally got the new padlocks on. You can't see much. Got torch on. No, you're not seeing much in there. Yeah, not much for us. Everything's just been screwed down and extra screwed down. But yeah, we're not getting in this one today, guys. We missed our window. As you can see, it's um, well and truly locked up from the public. It's a couple of hours since I left the last video, which was obviously a little fail. We couldn't get into the church. So we decided just to come to a couple of different locations and get them all in the same video. And uh, yeah, this is going to be another good one. So I'll show you that. Nice old stone formlet. Absolute beautiful evening for it. Oh dear. Bust my ankle again. Nice, nice old stone walls. Good condition. Very old pathway leading up into the bushes. Nice, lovely spot. Roadside. We've got about another four locations to go to after this, so this is just going to be an absolute packed video. A couple of different ways up. We've got a nice stairway. steps at either end and some more steps over there I can just see yeah I want to go up this way so yeah location tonight is uh, just approaching Halifax stunning archway Up again. Well built. Great condition apart from the big cracking ceiling. And that's us. The top roadside again. We've just parked up on the lower road. Don't know absolutely any history on this place whatsoever. I don't think this is going to be an information board. No, claim board. Nice lovely view over there. Just stop there for a picture. What a beautiful random place. 
There's the tower we just come up them steps from down there. So we'll just walk along here now, go back down the other steps and have a look at these little buildings, which are obviously buildings underneath the road or this um, grass area, should say. Another look down there. Well overgrown, but beautiful. Nice big post here. Oh, that's fun. Certainly an old one. Yeah, lovely little um, second location of the night. I think there's much more this way. You know, that's just the just the start of it there, a bit of a wall. Yeah, we'll get down these steps. any kind of access inside these buildings but just absolutely beautiful I love old natural stone and I love cleaning it too I have done um, I have done another jet washing video today another vlog on the jet washing job so yeah I'll be getting that on soon They've actually been concreted, cemented and bricked up. Let's see what this paperwork says. Boulevard Medical Practice registration form. Somebody who clearly didn't want to register. Or did they find it and want to build a fire? Who knows? Not sure whether someone's tried pulling these up to tunnel underneath or just to create a fire like a fire pit type just to keep the wind off it there's a couple of bits of evidence of fires but yeah you, this is certainly one that you're not getting in can't really see much in there Yeah, nice find. Ooh. Nice. So it is bricked. What a gas canisters. Yeah, I don't quite fancy squeezing down there. Oh, possibly there's some needles and bits and yeah there's plenty of needles down there that is not somewhere where you want to be somebody's bag there presuming there's some bits in there yeah plenty of needles down there and stuff nasty place to be and that's just what you've got to be careful for guys these guys have come in the bus bust the concrete door off sitting in there nice and warm with the gas canisters the needles and whatnot and you know what's next not a good lifestyle not a good place to be yeah i hope we get the help we need another bit of a bag there some more paraphernalia I don't want to touch the walls or anything, to be honest. It's um, just one of the creeps. But yeah, that's just uh, why you've got to be careful on these explos. Just trying to see if that goes around the corner. It's a very long alleyway. Yeah, I don't think so. I'm going to get out of here before I catch a disease. But yeah, it was awesome. Awesome find. And obviously they're gonna um, they're gonna find the hiding spots wherever they can to do what they need to do. That is what it is. Yeah, beautiful. Nice find and we're on to the next.
a little fire there. Not a bad location at all, that guys. Really liked it. Nice, really nice stonework. Yeah, I'm just going to give my mate a shout now and see where he is. And we'll head over to the next location. Stay tuned, guys. Just got over to the third location now, guys. There's your sneak preview. That's all you're getting. So this is the third location of this video which is the second location tonight we did head out this afternoon which is the start of the video um so yeah third location going in we need an entry point shouldn't be too hard just over here and um i don't know if you can see just through there my kind of um expo nice big huge abandoned mill has got fire damage so yeah taking it extra carefully this is going to be similar to the Fothergills factory which was my first video back probably around two months ago now but yeah we're just entering through this large forest area and i tell you what i have not seen one of them in a long time big cage on a big well for an overflow system beautiful love it nice big forested area absolutely stunning i will be sending the drone up on this one because i miss it it's been a while it's been too long since we've had it up in the air so we'll get that up so we've got sue's recycling center and we're just going to head up this path now flip that round for you guys so we just come up that, come down that track there into here. And I'm going having a nosy at this overflow because that is just absolutely fantastic. Haven't seen one of them for a while, mate. Beautiful that. Look at that. You do not want to drop your phone down there. Fall down there either. Absolutely solid. And there's its speed coming in. And there's our next location. Yeah, nice, nice, um, nice overflow system there. Really nice. Oh, wow. Wow. Absolutely stunning, that, guys. Fantastic. And pallets of some old stone there. And palletizing all the good stuff, chopping it down, getting what they can out of it. And of course, you sell that for very, very good money. piles of rubble you've got quite a lot of uh, stone out of it to be honest nice either side and big huge stone blocks and then your smaller pieces there uh, absolutely lovely that'll be a nice nice bit of smooth stone nice big shutter Same as last, last, uh, same as last location. I was going to say, but what I mean is same as the first location. Um, from the nosy and drainage, yeah, same as the first location, guys. Not sure if we can get in here, but we'll certainly get the drone up to have a nosy through the windows on each floor. Some rope from from top to bottom there. old ruins at walls huge absolutely huge yeah what a place 
What a beautiful place. So this is literally seven, eight minutes up road from our last location and literally pretty much central to Halifax. And yeah, just have a quick nosy right back, see if we can get in anywhere. If not, we'll get a drone up. Yeah, no signs of um, an entry point so far. We've only got this last side, some sort of huge oil drum. In our way though, I will not be climbing through that. <laughs> wow. Nice little step up. Still good to work that. Yeah, I don't think we're getting away in this oil. Absolutely stinks. Yeah, I'm not sure what's left of it inside, but I don't think we're getting in this one either, guys. Well, we can be here and we can appreciate it from the outside. We can get what footage we can with a drone. And yeah, that's about it. I'm going to head to another location after this and just try and catch sunset at a very high vantage point. Just having a nosy in trains. Obsessed. Yeah, I'll flip that round, let you have a look in here. I don't fancy climbing up there today, guys. Nice and clean. I like to keep it that way. Not much roof left on place. All the steel structure still in place. Just no sheets, corrugated sheets, probably asbestos. Old lintels propped up with some little pieces of timber. I think we'll find a nice nice position there to get seated and get the drone up and uh, see if we can have a nosy on them floors. There's a lot of random holes dug, which I don't quite understand. And they bricked it up.
finished up with drawn there now we've uh, got some some great video footage we put it through each floor all the way up so we could have an Aussie if you can't go in send the drone in be nice and safe so yeah that's uh, got some nice nice camera shots as well that's it for that one and we'll see if we can get another one in just got to our last location now guys this is Beacon Hill this is where they used to hang people um, but yeah just appreciate the beautiful views for a minute I'll flip that round for you So we're just going to go and try and get to a higher point and we can look over that way and that's going to show us all the way over Halifax Centre. That'll make a nice picture guys. Just notice that little tower there. There's another tower there which potentially might be another location for us. Yeah, nearly getting to the top of this hill now. Hopefully we get a nice, nice, lovely view of Halifax. <sighs> yeah, multiple locations done today. Oh, exhausting. Oh, we finally made it. And this is definitely worth it, guys. Check this out. Turn that round for you. And that's Halifax. Looking absolutely stunning this evening. It's been a lovely day in the UK today with obviously the standard British weather up to 20 degrees absolute burning sun three minutes later peeing down with rain another five minutes later the sun's back out this is what we deal with here in the uk but that is just absolutely beautiful guys that is worth that hike up the hill and this is our last location so i'm going to finish the video here but yeah just take that in little um, plaque so to speak just gives you all the information celebrating 100 years of Halifax it's got a map on there you read all the valuable information about all your landmarks and everything that's here wraps it up for today's video guys thank you very much for watching multiple locations in this video we've not actually been inside any abandoned buildings we've sent the drone in though so yeah we'll end this one here thank you very much for watching if you've not already please like subscribe leave a comment all that good stuff and yeah we've got some fantastic content coming up so stay tuned and see you soon All right, guys, so maybe it's not the end of the video. Maybe we've got one last, one last location for you on the way home. <sighs> Bit tired running down this forest. I'll just flip it around. Basically, what we've got here is an old police station. Well, what's left of it anyway? You can see there's a big old wall here. Look. Nice stream running to the right of us. There is a big pile of rubble up there, so I'm not sure whether they've knocked it down. But yeah, let's see what we can find. Some good old graffiti. Let's see what we can find in this one.
sure if that leads to anywhere. Don't think it does. Possibly might be the last remains of the police station. We'll, uh, we'll do a bit of puddle jumping for you. See what we can find. I think the uh, pile of rubble at the top, what we're seeing is uh, the last remains of the police station. Nice culvert there. Beautiful, I'm going to have just a quick jump up here. at police station left now not much at all yeah it was worth a quick look on way home as we were passing it yeah as you can see this is this is all what remains Obviously, they've had the excavators in, they've done the demolition and just left with a pile of bricks and the original wall around the outside and uh, just this little building at the bottom, what still remains. So, yeah, thought it'd have been a bit more exciting than that, but here's what it is another little location done. So, I'm going to cut it there before I climb down there. I don't want to fall talking to you guys, so thank you very much for watching. This is the end of the video. Stay tuned, I'll see you on the next one.